Welcome to FrameReady. This short video will demonstrate how to export contact information from your FrameReady program to an Excel spreadsheet. You will need to be logged in under the Level 4 account. The first thing we need to do is enable the full menus. From the main menu, go to the Perform menu and select Restore Full Menus. If you do not have a Perform menu, select Restore Full Menus from the Scripts menu. Navigate to the Contacts file. We now need to determine which contacts we want to export. To find all customers with an email address, simply click the Find All Email Addresses button. Another popular request is all the customers that have a mailing address. Click the Find button. Enter the star symbol into all the main address fields. Address, City, State, and Zip Code slash Postal Code. And click Perform Find. Go to the File menu and select Export Records. If you do not see this option, you need to return to the main menu and select Restore Full Menus from the Scripts or Perform menu. A Save As dialog box will appear. Usually, the best place to save the file is the desktop. That way it will be easier to find if you wish to email it later. Click the Save In drop-down box and select Desktop. Click in the file name box and type in a name. Sometimes it's a good idea to add today's date to the file name. To save this as an Excel spreadsheet, click in the Save As drop-down box and select Excel 95 to 2004 workbooks. Click the Save button. Make sure there is a check mark in the Use Field Names as Column Names in first row and click Continue. The Field Order Export section on the right displays all of the fields that will be included in the Excel spreadsheet. All of the fields listed on the left are fields that we can add. Double click on a field name on the left to add it to the file. We will add Company, Name First, Name Last, Address, City, State Prov, and Postal Code, which is the same as zip code. We can also remove fields on the right that we don't need simply by double-clicking on them. Please note that if you wish to add the email address and it's not already listed, you'll need to change from Current Layout to Current Table. Email address will then be visible. Once we're done, we can click Export. If we minimize FrameReady, we can see our exported Excel file on the desktop. This concludes this clip. Please return to our website to view more clips. Thanks for watching.